Well, I guess I've got two really favourite Christmas memories. One when I was a small child and the, the thrill that I had of celebrating Christmas with my elder brothers and my mum and my dad. But I think it goes to another level when you're a parent yourself and you see the excitement on the faces of your little ones uh, through the whole Christmas period, opening the presents, uh, being part of the Christmas feasting that goes on and being part of the Christmas message and the wonderful story that there is around Christmas. One that was really very special to me was 2014 when we hadn't had our son home for seven years and he and his family came home with our new granddaughter Milena and our grandchildren and our children were together and we had a wonderful Christmas. Look, I've got many childhood Christmas memories but I guess to put things into perspective uh, in more recent years of course the amount of Christmas activities that have grown right across our region from the CBD Christmas right out to our regional townships and other organisations that are bringing so many great community events to our region you know they're, they're probably memories that not only now I hold dear but will certainly be memories in the future. Probably one of my really favourite Christmases is um, my husband and I got married 23 years ago and we got married in late November in Brisbane and it was 41 degrees and we went on our honeymoon we went to Europe and it's the first time I'd ever been to Europe and it was all that white Christmas with the snow and the chestnuts and the sleighs. My favourite memory of Christmas takes me back to when I was a child and I was quite excitable child and I was quite excitable about Christmas and and I can remember, and unfortunately for my parents, I seemed to have a competition with my sisters as to who could get up the earliest on Christmas Day. And true story, one time I got up, I think it was literally 12.01 a.m. And Santa hadn't been, and there was no presents out, so I got really worried. My memories of Christmas from a very young age have been about uh, our very large family coming together uh, as a gathering from all over Australia. And uh, to me, that's what makes Christmas really special. My fond memory of Christmas is a huge piece of watermelon. As a bush kid, it was a privilege to have watermelon just at Christmas time. My favourite Christmas uh, memories are being able to spend time with my family. My probably most favourite one would be, uh, I guess many years ago, when all my grandkids were very, very small, and we had everyone there, all my children, uh, their husbands, wives, and we had one magnificent Christmas party Favourite Christmas memory is attending Christmas Mass on the evening before Christmas Day. On behalf of the ISG management team and our staff, I'd like to wish our community uh, a happy and holy Christmas and stay safe because we need you all back here in 2017. Hi, Councillor Nancy Summerfield here. Just wishing you all a Merry Christmas. I'm Chair of the Water and Waste Portfolio, that portfolio that delivers all those services to you, the important services that, are, that you don't even notice until things go wrong. So I'd like to wish you a Merry Christmas and may 2017 be filled with joy and good health. Uh, can I conclude by wishing you all, on behalf of my family, to you and your family, a very happy, safe and joyous festive season uh, with family and friends. Enjoy yourselves, but please, over the festive season, if you're travelling, stay safe. Return home safely. I look forward to working with you all once again in 2017. Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry Christmas to everyone in, within the region. Um, I hope that you have a safe and happy, fulfilling Christmas and are surrounded by people who love you and that you love them too. I'd just like to wish everyone a very Merry Christmas. I hope it's a happy time, I hope it's a safe time, and I hope you enjoy it with family and friends. To me, that's what Christmas is about, is spending time with family and friends. I hope you're able to do plenty of that over the Christmas season, and then have a very safe and enjoyable New Year. And we look forward to doing as much as we can again for you and your community in 2017. So this Christmas, I wish everybody in the Toowoomba region a very Merry Christmas. And uh, may you share it with your families, and may it be a happy time. And uh, let's bring some rain right across the region because I'm sure the farmers out there will be appreciating it. From my family to yours, I wish you a very Merry Christmas and a very Happy New Year and a prosperous one. I would like to wish the community a Merry Christmas and a very Happy and Prosperous New Year. Could I wish everyone in the entire region a very Happy and a Merry Christmas and may 2017 bring all your dreams, aspirations and anything else you've wanted to your fulfilment. I'd like to wish everybody a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year and I look forward to 2017 and being part of everybody's community. 
Christmas is a very special time and I hope each and every one of you get the opportunity to spend your Christmas with your family and your friends and enjoy their company and enjoy particularly the message of Christmas and what it means uh, to this community. Please be careful on our roads, but in doing so, uh, enjoy yourselves. Also, let's look at the future of this community uh, and how fortunate we are to live here. My trip to China this year uh, with a number of business people really reinforced in my mind just how very fortunate we are to live in this great community. How much we owe to those who've gone before us to prepare the way for us to provide this wonderful, democratic, peaceful country and this great area that we live in. We should be so thankful. So enjoy your Christmas, be careful on the roads and I want to see you back bright and chirpy in the new year when we face a very, very exciting 2017.